morning guys good morning welcome to another day of vlogmas can't lie your girl is feeling low girl's feeling low and i didn't want to come and lie about it because why why should i lie you know today i have a shoot day I've got another shoot day with ali but i'm just mentally not in it at all at all um i forgot some things at my booze place and so he's had to um leave and he's going to go and get them for me but i hate when i do stuff like that i hate when i'm scatter-minded and then i affect somebody else's day but the thing about my boo is that he really doesn't mind like one thing about him he's gonna ride out for me that's one thing i know for a fact he's always gonna ride out for me so he's even offered to go and get the bits that i need for the shoot so that i can basically stay here and prepare and get ready so that whenever ali comes i'm ready but i'm just really annoyed with myself like i need to get over being annoyed at myself so that i can move on forward because the situation is being handled you know i just hate when my mind is everywhere which it always is my mind is at three four five different places at the same time um it's even kind of why i'm reading that book or listening to that book getting things done uh it's just a really good book in terms of trying to organize your brain having lists and trying to just implement i don't even see i can't even think straight right now but just trying to implement practices that will allow you to remember things and categorize things and order things so that you can actually get things done you know so i'm just feeling really low like i'm just beating myself up over it but i need to stop and just start cleaning and get on with the rest of the day because today is meant to be a good day you know you, the day will be whatever you make it to be yeah so today's gonna be a shoot day ali's coming around later on you guys have met ali before when we were shooting my christmas vlog intro and so today i just have some work to do i've got two campaigns to shoot so i'm hoping that he can um we can get that done today but i do need to go over this hump i do i just hate when my inconveniences inconvenience others it is what it is you know shout out to my boot always a rider one thing about him you're gonna jump in for me every single time yeah let me clean up and then let's try and shake up my mood so that by the time Ali gets here, I'm feeling like my usual self again. First, let's wash these dishes. Somebody, people are always surprised that I don't have a dishwasher. It's very normal not to have a dishwasher. You know that, right? Very, very normal. The reason, I don't know why I need to justify the reason why I don't have a dishwasher, but the reason why I don't have a dishwasher is because I don't have space. My house is quite, you know, quite tight ever since we removed this wall if you guys don't know if you're new to my channel um i basically bought this house and it looked like an old man's house okay that's the best way to put it the walls were green <laughs> the walls were green and there was a big wall right here see this thing on the roof there there was a wall right there i'm sure most of you who are watching know about this but if you don't know then yes that's removing of that wall just basically took out half of the kitchen because here if there's a wall here there would have been a cabinet here there have been cabinets all along here and at the bottom here but because we removed that i've literally reduced my kitchen size by like 50 percent so there's no space to put something like a dishwasher hence why i gotta wash my dishes myself but it is what it is i've been washing dishes all my life <laughs> i've been washing dishes all my life when i have some children then i'll have a dishwasher and I won't buy a dishwasher. The children will be the dishwasher, okay? So that's how I grew up. And that's how I'm gonna raise my until. I'm already feeling better. Let me just usa and get back into myself and then we can get ready for this shoot. So it is much later on. I have got ready. The kitchen is clean. Ali came. Um, Boo got all my things for the shoot that we needed. Like everything. Is back in order okay things feel good again <laughs> i am now in the bathroom i'm just thinking about what i'm gonna wear for the shoots i'm shooting two campaigns today i need to shoot my bacardi campaign which i need this outfit for yeah because it's kind of very it was very christmasy themed so i've already submitted my content idea to the brand and they they they, they say they like it in principle so i now need to actually make it and shoot it i've got a storyboard of what um shots i want to get so that it should be like a bish bash bosh job and then i also have my gym campaign to shoot as well and that i'm gonna wear my velvet lux set the other velvet lux set the green one because um the bottle is green so i think that'll go really well they're both very festive i've just realized both are very festive shoots but yeah feeling good i feel like everything feels back good again my hair is straight again quite like it straight i wasn't sure of it before but i do like it minimal makeup yeah let's go and shoot i've literally just been eating chocolate the whole day what is going on and to make it worse well better but worse my neighbor came but my neighbor came by to drop off this giant slab of 
is it upstairs here no um giant slab of um cadbury's cadbury's chocolate and it's so much chocolate i need to stop i don't even like chocolate that's the thing i will eat chocolate if it's there but i'm not a chocolate babe i'm a sweet refined processed haribo sugar kind of babe <laughs> So bad. Also, this lip combo is such a vibe. It is so nice. Let me show you. Let me turn this light on. This is my new lights. I'm gonna have them linked below. Mm -mm -mm. That is so cute. It is the Bare Minerals. It's a little tester one that I have. Bare Minerals lip gloss in Gen Nude. Oh, and then I used the Kiko Creamy Color Comfort Lip Liner in three, two, one. Three, two, one, and it's done. Those lights are really good too. You see that? I like them. Lights on everywhere. Where am I going? I gotta pay these bills. One second. Turn off this one. Turn off that one. Turn off the bathroom one. Turn off the mirror. Oh, so many lights. Turn off the corridor. Entryway, dots, room. Oh my God, I'm bleeding dry. What's going on? Okay, that's enough. For all those lights. Jeez. Okay, so content idea. Decorate your space is the first one. So that's the one decorating the tree. A shot of like doing the tree up. Nice bouquet um, okay. situation. Number two, choose a theme or a dress. That's when we do the transition. Mm. With, oh no, number four, playing the games. We could do domino. I might even just do like a little thing around the table. That makes sense. And then goes to the drink. And then that's the yeah, final. That makes sense. That'd be cool. Because we could play the game or we could just have them stacked yeah, up. Just have it, yeah, just the, stacked the up. The domino effect is a great, yeah, domino yeah, effect. great visual. And then we can push one and then the camera the can follow it all around. Yeah. yeah. Funny. One shot like that. Yeah. Yeah. Love got that. Two cameras, so you can, yeah, got a team today. The team. I am the team. I am the makeup. I am the hair. I've got two photographers, I've got a boo, and I've also got Ali. And our snacks, unfortunately, today are just rich tea biscuits. That's very unfortunate. Bottom tier biscuits. Oh, Absolutely. No shade, just in case. Bottom tier biscuits. Oh, like, and, then, what? and a lovely somebody also. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, that's what the name Thank you to that somebody. My neighbor, this is the one I was telling you guys. Look at why are the chocolate bars that big? It's bigger than my head. That's, it's a lot of chocolate. Babe, could you eat all of this in one go? It's not possible. Ali, Where I know you could. Chat? I, you're calling me fat. I know you could. <laughs> you're calling me fat. I know you take this on. I would eat more than that. In one sitting? One sitting? As one in... movie? <laughs> <laughs> one movie. When I was a child, I would have backed it, but now, absolutely not. This just looks like a headache tomorrow, like a stomach ache tomorrow. That's the 30 plus talking. Honestly. <laughs> We're just setting up the Christmas tree seems to be moved at the moment. Being moved. I need to buy a shredder guys and I need to buy a shredder ASAP because there's so many letters that come in and I just don't want That's to it. deal with it. Uh, um and then this also came. Remember the thing that I ordered before? Is that the My sleep mask. Not but um the yeah, we're just setting up right here. Setting up the shot. We wanna shoot from yeah, outside the window again, the way we shot the Tell me when. Christmas intro. Yeah. Oh, but wait, I need to be in my black in my black outfit first, no? Because remember, yeah, for the yeah, second yeah, thing, yeah, I'm yeah. going to change into the... I meant to say that to you. Yeah. This camera? Yeah. Oh, okay, the vlog. Y'all got to go. You're, you're interrupting. Yeah, that was good. One more, and this time next. Be this way. Right. Your body a bit more that way. Face towards the light. Yeah. All right, perfect. I think we got it. One take, one Three, two, one, go. <laughs> yep, that was great. <laughs> So next shot. So Is I'm it going to be from here to there? Yeah, I'm going to come and just place it here like... Overly the top happiness, keep going, great work. Two dashes of bitters. When you're trying to do different shots, when you're trying to do multiple shots, it requires you to like literally redo everything twice over and have the set up the same. So I need to put everything back to where it was here. And then the drink. I need to make the drink again. Oh, oh, I mean, you got it on camera. <laughs> what the hell? Was that vlog was on? Yeah. As you can see, that guys. That wasn't meant to happen. <laughs> that was literally the last one. Can't just sabotage my operation. Oh god. Well, at least it kind of worked. Oh. As you can see, guys. Once again. We have finished one shoot, which was the Bacardi one. Next one is just about to get started. It's eight o'clock already. 
but we are just going to steam through it. This one is just a picture, so it shouldn't be too hard. And just some videos for stories. This is our little setup here. The Christmas tree is gonna be our backdrop. Next shoot, meaning next outfit. This one, as the bottle has got green in it, I wanna wear my green Velvelux PJ set to shoot. Boo's also going to get food just so that the energy can stay up. Yeah, but to be honest guys, I feel like I'm, this is gonna be quite a short vlog. So I'm gonna insert right here as we're shooting downstairs, I'm gonna insert um, a little surprise that I had for my parents the other week. <laughs> I went home and I had a little bit of a surprise delivery for them. So I'm gonna insert that footage here and then as we're shooting downstairs, we can catch up again once we have finished the shot and once Boo is bringing back food. So for the meantime, let's cut to the surprise that I had for my parents just the other week. The doors bang on 70? No, the width is 70. 69 with the doors off. Like 10 mm. Morning guys, good morning. Waking up at my parents' house today and I am so excited to be here because their delivery of all of their LG appliances are arriving today. I am so geeked about this. I can't believe that I even get the chance to surprise and spoil my parents like this. Thank you so much to LG for hooking your girl up with this. These are the doors. They had to take the doors off. Um, they are really nice. I wish you could see the texture on this it's so good so good it's such a pretty fridge oh mom's calling let me even show her hey mom they're here the fridge is here but the fridge is big let me show you it's a nice fridge it's an american fridge can you see there's two doors they had to no it's black mom it's black no they had to take the they had to take the doors off it for it to fit look at that well done Oh, well done. What is going on? Now it's dad. <laughs> These lot won't let me rest. Oh, where's my phone? One sec. Amosi, can you? Bad. You do I have been trying to chat to you for the last hour, but I keep getting interrupted. But here we are finally. What I've been trying to say is that LG got in touch, asked if I wanted to try some of their products, and I was like, absolutely yes. In fact, I didn't even have to try their products, I already have done that before. If you guys remember when I used to stay with my auntie, she had like this big white LG fridge and it's so good, like she never gave her any issues. So when LG got in touch saying, would I like to try their fridge and some of their products? I was like, absolutely. But you guys know my home, there's literally no more space in my home. So I said, let me surprise my parents instead. Let me treat my parents. So here we are, they've been delivered today. And oh my goodness, guys, I had to even, let me get my notes up. In my notes, y'all see this? You see that what it says there? It says Andy and John product care. Guys, I had to take down the names of the delivery guys because they were excellent. There's only two occasions where I take down the names of the person who's like serving me. The first and more common reason is usually when they've given me terrible service and I need to know their name so that I can call up their manager and be like, sort your staff out. But the second reason is when they give great service. This. This doesn't happen often, but I actually literally wrote their names down because Andy and John from Product Care at LG, fantastic. Like they literally made it all of their effort to make sure that this fridge was delivered. As you can see, it's a big American style fridge. It is double doors um, and oh, it's so nice. I'll show it to you a little bit later. Um, Cause right now it's off. When you deliver a fridge, you need to give it like three hours to stand up straight and all of that. So I'll turn it on later on and I'll show it to you. Yeah, Andy and John, fantastic. Like initially I wasn't sure if I was gonna be able to fit through these small doors, but they literally took all of their time to make sure that it came in. But even in that, they were here for about 50 minutes. What? And they had to put this big fridge in here and fit the washing machine. Oh, lovely stuff. I'm so excited. And as you guys could tell as well, my parents are very excited. They literally both rang me back to back. They're both like, let me see, is it delivered? Is it there? I wanna know, I wanna see. Like, they love it. They're so excited. <laughs> I'm so happy, I'm so glad when I can do stuff like this. I love when my job affords me um, the opportunity to be able to like spread that to other people and other people to feel the joy of the work that I do as well. So I am so eagerly anticipating my parents to come back this evening because 
they rang, like both of them rang back to back. Like they wanted to see it being fitted. They wanted to see how it looks. And I kind of low key wish I'd just not shown it to them. I wish I had just said, oh, they're not here so that they could come and I could catch their surprise on camera. But I mean, I don't even know if they want to be filmed to be honest, but I am so, so happy. Like, thank you so much to LG. What? This fridge is insane. Like this fridge, you, you tap it, you knock it, and then the screen comes on and you can see what's inside the shelves. I can't wait to turn this on. And the washing machine, honestly, is so plush. So the fridge behind me is a smart fridge and freezer. It's got loads of different features like child lock on it so that children can't just run up in the fridge. Also got a digital display. It's also got fast freezing, smart technology, and also temperature display. Like it is a full on American style fridge it's got absolutely everything even including the ice and water machine oh sorry but the best daughter goes to who it's me i'll take that crown i'll wear my crown i shall wear my crown my joe phrasing crown because only kings and queens treat their parents like this Shout out to LG though, because boy. I'm definitely gonna leave like all these stickers and the plastics for my mom to peel off herself because there is literally nothing more exciting than peeling off all of the plastic and the cellophane from your new products. She's gonna love it. I can't wait to plug it in and knock twice to see inside. Now that's posh. This is a setup for the next shot. The Christmas tree is the background. It should be nice and neat. curtain pulls I don't even know if you could see me but um basically my curtains are getting dirty <laughs> my very nice luxe curtains are getting dirty from like me using my grubby little fingers to open them so I want to get curtain pulls and tie backs as well because these curtains are too damn nice and luxe for them to be getting dirty let me even show you let me give you a little close up they are so stunning they're so thick they're so well made I wish you could like I wish you could feel them because if you could feel them you'd absolutely know what i'm talking about but look at here look at this i've got makeup on my curtains and i feel so mad i'm so annoyed at myself they're double lined they're black out they're gorgeous but now they're getting dirty so we need to sort that out anyway good morning guys good morning i normally wouldn't do this i wouldn't start the next day's vlog without ending last night but <laughs> you know <laughs> what happened was we got carried away shooting basically and then once the shoot was done ali wasn't feeling too good like he really wasn't feeling too good at all um he had a lot of back pain and a big old headache so we were just kind of trying to get it done quickly so that ali could get home um and get some rest basically but he woke up he's woken up this morning he's texting me saying that he's feeling a lot better i got him a car to send him all the way home instead of having to take um tfl because yeah he is so helpful like oh, we did so much work yesterday well we shot the two big campaigns that i really wanted to shoot um and i'm very happy with um how everything looks when you guys see them online please go and ride for your girl and support please by liking the posts because it does help me out but anyway i wanted to come and end the vlog with a few things first I wanted to give you guys feedback on the mask the sleep mask came i know that i briefly mentioned this yesterday in the vlog but like literally we're in the middle of stuff so i tried it guys 12 out of 10. this thing is amazing like you see the way it's the way it's padded the way it's been made is literally so that it blacks out all of the light when i say all i mean like when i have this on I have my eyes wide open and I literally cannot see a single thing. It is so good. 
40 pounds pricing but absolutely worth it if you're looking for a sleep mask and it's also really comfy on the eye because as you can see it's padded i guess because it's made by the guys temper who make uh, mattresses it kind of folds into your shape of your eyes so it's really comfortable like super comfortable and then the next thing that i wanted to shout about is I got some bits in PR. Becca, I got these ages ago, but I only just opened them. And this foundation is so good. I think I might even have to do like a, would you guys want to see like me getting ready? Would you want to do like a girl chat, get ready with me? If so, let me know. Maybe you guys could even send questions. I know that Aaliyah's face does something really similar where she does like a Q and A where you guys send in like dilemmas. In fact, quite a lot of people do that kind of style of video. But um, let me know if you guys want to see that from me. We could even make it like a Prosecco chat. I'll be drinking, answering some questions, not questions, maybe answering some of your dilemmas. Let me know if you wanna see that. The other day you saw Toby and I going um, candle shopping. I really want a new candle. Um, and a few weeks back, like I've been looking for candles for a few, like quite a few weeks now. Um, I had put it on my stories that I'm searching for candle brands and you guys sent me a whole list of candle brands, including this here, which is Nicholas Kingsley, right? So I reposted onto my story, um, all of the responses. And because I tagged this brand, they decided to send me the candle for me to try it out. And I thought that's amazing, what? Um, thank you for your purchase, it was actually a gift. Our luxury diffusers are 100% non-toxic, vegan friendly and sourced from natural pure essential oils, handcrafted with environmentally friendly packaging, made for royalty, show us and tag us. This is so cute, thank you so much guys for sending me this candle. And look, I had to come and open it, like I really wanted to end the vlog with a bit of an unboxing of PR and I know that I've been looking forward to this. Oh, it's a bit tight here. But you know, um, I was even thinking about putting this under the tree, but I actually just want my candle. <laughs> I want my candle and I'm gonna let you guys know in the next vlogs what this smells like. I'm gonna burn it properly and then let you know. Wow. Guys, just by opening the box alone, I can already smell the diffuser. It's still in the box. It's still in the box. What? I can already smell it. This smells absolutely delicious. This is ridiculous. Oh, this is the perfect smell. What is that smell? Serenity Allure. That smells divine. It smells like perfume. It smells like oud. Guys, I am the worst person to try and explain what scent things are, but it smells buff. That's all you need to know. It's, it fills up the room and it smells buff. And it's a diffuser. Do I need to, uh, do I need to take this apart? I think I can just leave that stick on. Do I leave the little bell on or not? But this smells amazing. Oh, this is gonna stay in my room. Oh, should I put it downstairs? Am I gonna be selfish if I keep it upstairs in my room? Should I put it downstairs in the corridor? It smells divine. Oh, that's amazing. I'm gonna leave that there for now. I don't know if I'm gonna be selfish. So how many mils is this? This is a hundred mil um, luxury diffuser, Serenity Allure. Wow. I'm gonna take them apart. I feel like when I've taken them apart, it smells even better. It smells even stronger. That is, that is buff. Oh, thank you so much. I'm so glad, wow. I'm so, so glad that smells so strong. That's like, I can literally feel it filling up the room. That's amazing. And then there's one last thing that I wanted to show you guys, but this, oh my God, this PR is literally over a year old. This is from Freeborn Nobles Company. You guys, I think I just saw the other day that she won Entrepreneur of the Year. She won an award recently. Um, and I just thought, you know what, shout out to her. This, she sent me this like literally last year or even a year and a half ago when I was in the middle of my move. And literally it has been unopened all that time because things are everywhere in my house. But I am gonna be needing these very soon. It's basically a traveling wig bag. So you can clip your wig on here and then you put it inside here. So kind of like a suit, you know you get suit bags well, this is a wig bag. This is perfect for traveling. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. If you have anywhere to go, if you have anywhere to go, the inside of this is silk lined, guys. It's so soft, can you see? 
Let me bring you in, yeah. So you can see the silk lining inside. So your wig, even if it's styled already, it will maintain its style, it'll maintain its moisture. And then you just wrap it like that and you take it with you. This is so good. Let me show you what I was doing to my wigs before. This is so bad. This is like anti-advertising. Let me show you. This is me being real. See this? That is how my wig was previously stored. I Guys, I'm not lying. <laughs> You've literally seen me pull it out. This is my jewelry case. I was needing this. And my watch. I, I've been looking for this. And the charger too. So all my stuff was just in this bag. That's crazy. I've literally been looking for all this stuff. <laughs> including oh my gosh yeah right anyway so you don't need to do this to your wig you don't need to destroy your perfectly gorgeous wigs like this oh god this is terrible so i'm gonna brush this up and then basically start using this wig bag honestly i am so glad to have these two bags i can't believe how long i have been blocking my own blessing this is ridiculous. Like, look at the state of my wig. But a big shout out to Camilla, man. Shout out to Freeborn Noble. Guys, I'm gonna leave all the details below. Go and support a black owned business, of course. Go ride out and support. And I know your wig needs these. But yeah, that's pretty much it. There's other PR here. Um, let me show you one last thing. One last thing, because this is also black owned. I also got sent these eyeshadow palettes. This is OPV Beauty. Um, I think I'm gonna do that, get ready with me, because these are palettes, so I can do an eye look, and then I've got the foundation, so I can also do skin. Let me know if you guys wanna see, and I'm, I'm gonna try, I'll try my best. So the palettes that I received from OPV Beauty are, is the Born to Shine palette, and the Yemi Joa palette. Um, let me quickly show you what it looks like. So this is the Born to Shine blush palette. I love these burnt oranges colors. I love this one. This is me. The whole bottom row is me. And then I can even see this on my cheeks too. So that would be really nice for the cheeks. So this is the Yemoja palette. I think that's how you even say it. I think these are blushes. No, sorry, I think these are eyeshadows. I love these colors. Oh, these two are delicious. And that burnt color as well. This is that palette. That is pretty much it guys. That is pretty much it for the vlog. Let me know what you guys think. Also my parents absolutely love, love the LG appliances. Like they haven't stopped talking. I think I may have just one daughter of the year. Sorry to my other siblings. Like you guys can just sit aside for now because this year I took it home. I brought it home. Cause like what? <laughs> that fridge is buff. That fridge is extremely buff. The fact that you can just knock on the door and then it comes on, it's ridiculous. It's absolutely, like I, I feel so blessed that this is my job so that I can also then gift my parents things like this because of my work. That, like as an African child, I have succeeded. I really have, and it's all thanks to you guys. So yeah, um, I hope you guys are enjoying Vlogmas as much as I am. Um, even though the girl, the girl was down for a day or two, but you know, we're gonna keep it kicking. I promised you guys 25 videos and I'm gonna deliver 25 videos this December. So until next time guys, I shall see you in my next video. Bye guys.